Hi, I'm Jason Hurtis, and today I'd like to talk to you about the efficiencies that you can gain from the CAT payload systems. So let's get started. I'll start by covering some basics of loading and then move into the payload systems themselves. On a job site, if all you have are your eyes and the machine controls to load trucks, accurate loading of those trucks can be quite a challenge. Let's take a look at what typically happens on a job site. I'll go ahead and I'll lay in your job site for you here. And I'll also bring in a wheel loader. So we'll go ahead and bring in our truck right here. Now as a wheel loader operator, you want to move as quickly as possible to that truck, but at the same time, you don't want to be spilling material outside the bucket or over the side of the truck. So let's change our perspective a bit. What most wheel loader operators have a tendency to do is overload the front of the truck or overload the truck completely. Loading this way really is not good for trucks. Let me show you what happens. Okay, we'll go ahead and we'll zoom in right here. With all that weight in the front of the bed, it has a tendency to overload your front axle here and your hoist cylinders right here. Most people think these are heavy duty trucks, so what's bad about that? The answer is plenty. All that front loaded extra weight can cause additional maintenance and premature wear. Not to mention what that extra weight can do to your tires. Just a 20% overload results in a 50% reduction in tire life. Not to mention changes in cycle times, increased fuel consumption, and lost production. So you can see how overloading can dramatically affect your bottom line. So we know that overloading or underloading trucks is bad. However, there's good news. CAT payload systems provide on-the-go weighing for the operator to allow him to hit precise load targets each and every time. By using CAT payload systems, this increases the operator's effectiveness, reduces their fuel consumption, and increases their productivity. And it's easy to get all these benefits because CAT payload systems are easy to operate. Let me take you on a quick tour. All right, let's go ahead and climb inside of this loader. Over here you'll find your integrated monitor and let's blow that up to take a look at the payload screen. On the payload screen, over here on your left, you'll find all the information you need to know about your truck, the number of passes that you've made in that truck, and what the current payload is. Here in the center of the screen, you'll find information about your target payload. You can select different truck IDs, different material IDs. And over here on the right side of the screen, it tells you everything you need to know about your bucket how much material you have in the bucket, and that green box indicates that it's gone through the weigh range, giving you the most accurate weight. Now I'm going to go ahead and go through a loading technique. Let's see what that looks like. Okay, we have our monitor here, so we can see how this works when we begin to load. We'll go ahead and recall the previous scene, and we'll start to load with our wheel loader, and you can see on the monitor it's weighing the material going into the bucket as the boom rises without any interruption to the loading cycle. Notice how the monitor shows the weight of the bucket and the cumulative payload of our truck. Hauling systems also have payload systems on them and they consist of red or green lights or external scoreboards to give the loader operator an indication of how many more passes or additional passes are needed to load that truck. So as he sees the green light he continues to load that truck to its target payload. Let's go ahead and hit reset here but you'll notice over on my truck the red lights flashing indicating that I have one more pass to put on that truck to get it to its target payload. So let's go ahead and put that pass on that truck. We'll go ahead and start here and we'll make our dig, fill in our bucket and you can see up here on the monitor it's telling me how much weight I have in that bucket. It's also telling me if I put that entire bucket in that truck I will be overloading that truck. That's where tip-off becomes important. The tip-off feature allows the wheel loader operator to adjust his final bucket payload to exactly match the target payload of that truck. The way that he does that is he slowly tips that bucket off into the stockpile and you'll see here on the monitor the weight of that bucket is actually decreasing as I turn that bucket. Once I get to the target payload I rack the bucket back 
and I deliver that payload to my truck, dumping the entire bucket into that truck, ensuring that it hits its target payload. Once that process is done, the whole entire process starts over with loading a new truck. All right, let's go ahead and get rid of that monitor, and let's change to a top view. In addition to the payload systems that we just showed you, CAD also offers offboard systems that will take that payload data and allow you to use it for benchmarking, cost, and trend analysis. So regardless of the industry that you're in, whether it's coring aggregates or heavy construction, CAT payload can save you time, money, and fuel. Thank you.